So, the adventure begins. Hey Wanderers, as you know, it's self-care February and I had the privilege of seeing Paige, a licensed esthetician at PA Skin, to get some treatments done and she has some tips for you all. So today I'm getting a facial and I'm getting a Brazilian wax from Paige Van. I'm excited. My skin, um, I'm normally really complimented on having clear skin and this I am very aware this isn't bad. But it's been breaking out in the quarantine. I don't know if it's these masks. I don't know what it is, but um, maybe what I'm consuming. I'm still drinking a lot of water. It's still not doing it, but um, getting ready to do the Brazilian, knock that out first. Obviously not gonna have footage of that, but we'll discuss some of it. And then um, the facial. Look for... You can use hard wax which adheres to the hair and reduces risk of skin irritation. Soft wax adheres to the skin but great for larger areas, i.e. legs, back, chest. The sugaring which is basically a hard wax but with a sugar base in the application and removal can be different. For waxing, you need the hair to grow about a fourth to a half inch. For Brazilians, it's best to keep with your schedule so that every time you won't feel like the first time. You will eventually become more accustomed to the feeling. 3. Delay exfoliating for about 3 days. Please clean areas that will be waxed prior to your appointment. So it looks like you kind of have combination skin. Okay. I might just be like oiling your T zone here. And maybe drying on the cheeks where you have a normal. So here, where you were talking about that, some of these are blackheads. All of the couple of these are blackheads. Some of them are just like purples. But the ones that are blackheads, they are embedded kind of deep. This one's a little inflamed. So we'll try to extract those. Depending on the skin, I mean, it doesn't look actually, it don't look like it's really dry. Oh, good. Yeah, there are some little breakouts. But if you notice, it's in the mask area. Mm -hmm. So that's always going to be there for a minute. Um, and your home care is going to have to step up. And then when I tell people with the masks, you got it like this, it should be cleansed, cleaned, washed as frequently as possible because if it's just laying around and doing all those things that bacteria is getting on you and you're already breathing and stuff so make sure you do that sometimes i'll tell people if you're going to have a very long day outside these and bring like two or three of them they change it okay oh, change it. Uh, yeah because most of this is just like it's some simple mask I mean, this one looks there's one right here very deep i doubt we'll get it today i'll put some extra enzyme there to break it down some but it's kind of like closed off Facial etiquette and tips. One, do not go to YouTube and try experimental facial products or techniques and then book a facial. Why? You can compromise your skin barrier, which may limit the type of facial or could possibly prevent the esthetician from performing a facial. Two, follow home care routine. An esthetician provides that for a reason. For pills, there are specific home care regimens that must be followed in order to achieve desired results and to avoid negative effects. 3. Be honest with your esthetician at the time of your consultation. Certain questions are asked to avoid contraindications and to allow you a thorough skin analysis and treatment plan. One thing I did love about uh, visiting PA Skin and Paige for my facial and Brazilian wax was that I did not feel rushed. I felt like, I didn't feel like just another appointment with her. Um, I felt like she took her time, evaluated what I needed, and was able to successfully um, provide the treatments that I needed for my skin. I know we talk about self-care, February being not all about pampering, and doing the internal work in order to love yourself and to be a better you. But I mean, pampering is nice and definitely plays a role. So I appreciated this pampering session that she gave me.
Gentle reminder, wanderers, you can't pour from an empty cup. Take care of yourself first. I was sent home with these products. Game changer. Skin is flawless. If you want to get some self-care in, check out Paige at www.paskininc.com or text or call at 708-738-9881.